Hi students, good morning. Today in science lesson, we are going to start chapter number two, lesson number two. We have already finished lesson number one. We have finished the exam for it also. So we are going to start lesson number two, which is called motions of the earth. This is earth. Okay, and we are going to see about how it moves, what does it move against, and what happens with the earth, the sun, and the moon. Okay, only these three things we are going to see in this lesson. So today is part one of this lesson where we are going to see about how the earth moves. Earth kaise move karta hai, we are going to see. Okay, Kavitri has an earth to explain this to you. We will see as we go along the lesson. First, this is a top. Ye top hai. Top means what? Lattu. Okay, it turns around itself along an imaginary line. Okay, ye top ko aap gumaoge, if you turn it, you can see that it turns around itself. Wo khud se gumta hai, kisi aur ko a circle nahi karta hai, khud se gumte rata hai ek hi jagah pe. But what happens? It is moving along an imaginary line. Imaginary matlab we can't see. Imaginary means we can't see the line. But there is a line and it keeps rotating around that. So that's called rotation. Okay. That's called what it keeps circling around itself and that's called rotation. So this line, okay, it keeps rotating around that line. If you can see here, the imaginary line around which it rotates is called its axis. Jo imaginary line, imaginary matlab hume dikta nahi hai, around which the top rotates is called the axis. Ye jo line hai, usko axis kehte hai. And the turning of an object around itself is called rotation. Jo object, jo cheese, kuch se gumta hai apne aap, that's called rotation. Okay? Now this is what a lattu does or a top does. What does the earth do? Okay? If you see, the earth also keeps rotating. Earth bhi gumta hai kuch se on an imaginary line. Can you see a line? So that's called its axis. If you can see here also, Earth slowly, 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 slowly gumta hai. But kahan gum raha hai along this line. So ye axis of the Earth hai and ye rotation hai. Ye, the line is called axis of the Earth and gumna is called rotation. So if you can see, this is the Earth. The Earth turns around itself along an imaginary line. Earth could se gumta hai along an imaginary line which we can't see. That is called its axis. And jo gumna, the turning of an object around itself is called rotation. So the turning of an object around itself could se gumna is called rotation. And the imaginary line that we cannot see, that's called axis. Ye axis hai. Ye axis hai. And jo gumna, the turning of an object, that's called rotation. Okay. Now, if you can see, like a top, a top my axis straight. Okay. But if you see Earth pe, the Earth pe the axis is not straight. Straight hai kya? No, it's not straight. It's slanting. It's slanting. It's tilted or it is slanting. Straight to aise hona chahiye na, but it's slanting. So, the Earth's axis is tilted. Tilted means it's slanting and it's not straight. And jo upar wala part hai earth ka, jo upar wala part hai, that's called the north pole. And jo niche wala part hai, that's called the south pole. Jo bhi, what's on up is called north pole and this is called the south pole. N is north pole, S is south pole. Okay? So usually a north pole and south pole are where it is very, very cold. Earth mein, this north pole and south pole are where it's very, very cold. And kya kya animals udar rehte hai, pata hai? Udar, polar bear, uh, then penguins, whale, blue whale, and other animals live in the Arctic and the Antarctic, the north pole and the south pole, because it's very, very cold there. Okay? Now, what all did we see? We saw that the earth turns around itself. The earth turns around itself. This is called rotation. This imaginary line, this imaginary line is called its axis. This axis is not straight. It's theta, it's slanting, it's tilted. Okay. And we saw that this is the North Pole and this is the South Pole where penguins, polar bears and whales and all live. 
another thing if you see a line axis a a seedha wala line axis a but there is also a line sa and horizontal line if you can see here which divides the earth into two parts sa ek line which divides the earth into two parts okay that line is called the equator this line is called the equator it divides the line, uh, earth into two parts upar wala part is called the northern hemisphere and niche wala part is called the southern hemisphere okay upar wala part is called the northern hemisphere and niche wala part is called the southern hemisphere so jo upar hai northern hemisphere niche hai southern hemisphere and if you see on the earth if you can see india india is here okay india is here so that's all that we saw in today's lesson what all did we see earth rotates around itself on an axis which is tilted this is north pole this is south pole both are very cold regions there is a line called equator which divides the earth into two parts and what are those parts northern hemisphere and southern hemisphere so half mein cut karta hai ye line aur axis pe ghumta hai earth and that's called rotation okay this is all today's video i will explain to you what you need to do in your homework next